As we wrap up the year, we're looking back on the top stories from 2023 here in Southeast Texas, from Golden Triangle Grove to Power City. And tonight we're taking a look at some wild weather that hit our region. Here's Storm Tracker meteorologist Jeremiah Stewart. We only have a few days left of 2023 left, and it's been a year to remember. But before we kick off the new year, let's take a look back at some of the most monumental weather events from the year of 2023. It's an experience that I wouldn't want anybody to go through. He was trying to get to her, so we was just, it happened so quick, we didn't really know what to do. In January, the Marcantle brothers' lives were changed forever when the Bridge City and Orangefield communities were struck by unusual wintertime twisters. The tornadoes packed winds in excess of 100 miles per hour, leaving behind multiple paths of destruction and dozens of residents in dismay. Luckily, there were no fatalities, but it took months for the communities to recover. As you can see, my little shed is underwater. In April, Beaumont's north end was flooded by heavy rainfall. The flooding was further exasperated by construction nearby, inconveniencing dozens of local residents. Months later in June, another round of storms rolled through southeast Texas, snapping trees and power lines and knocking out the power of more than 30,000 residents. The summer of 2023 was one of the hottest and driest on record, with 99 consecutive days of 90 degree plus heat. And the sweltering heat, accompanied by the dry weather conditions, led to wildfire and drought crisis across the region. 12 News had team coverage of the Sherwood Creek Fire in Jasper County, burning more than 3,000 acres and warranting mandatory evacuations. It was grass and it started working its way toward the, the bushes. And when the bushes caught on fire, that's when we got out. The 22-inch rainfall deficit led to burn bans and water restrictions across the region. And rainfall was so scarce that in September, dozens of Southeast Texans gathered together to pray for rain. A slight increase in rain in October, November, and December answered some prayers, although much of the region remains in an exceptional drought as of December of this year. Those are the most impactful weather events in Southeast Texas for the year of 2023, and only time will tell what Mother Nature has in store for the year of 2024. Jeremiah Stewart, 12 News.